What's up, pals? So I just woke up and I decided I'd do a little get ready with me, you know, show you what I do in the morning, how I get ready. This is what I do in the morning. Good stretch. I look like absolute death. I've never looked worse, but we're just going to ignore that and move right along. Takes me a minute to wake up, but I'll get there eventually. Don't worry about me. So yeah, let's get started with our day. Wow. That is not a great sight. Alrighty, so the first thing I always, always do when I first wake up is drink water it's so important i can't stress it enough drink water always and then i like to set the vibe of my <laughs> i hated that but i always like to turn on my fairy lights open my window turn on these two lights light a candle and now let's hop in the shower i am not gonna wash my hair because i literally washed it yesterday and it's really bad to wash your hair every single day i can't be the only one who does this like take showers but doesn't get their hair wet I can't be the only one, right? Please make me feel not alone. <laughs> I'm gonna show you what products I use. For body wash, I use this coconut body wash. My perfume and my body wash are both coconut scented. This is my shampoo. I use the sun bun, but what? What? Yeah, you get it. This is my conditioner. The cap is off, I'm not sure why, but this stuff smells so good, oh my goodness. So I don't use a ton of products in the shower, but when I get out, I always use this. So since I'm not washing my hair, I won't be using this today, but it, this keeps my hair so healthy. Occasionally, I'll spray a little bit of this in my hair to keep it light, because naturally my hair is pretty dark, so this just helps it stay blonde. I'm gonna hop in the shower. I can't see what I'm filming currently because you're literally in my little cabinet. I can't look at the little viewfinder where I see myself because there's no room and I'm a little bit stressed about it, but it's alright. The classic brush of the teeth. I just use Tom's toothpaste. In the morning, I don't use a face wash because I already use one at night and I don't want to overload my skin, so I'm just going to wash it with water like I usually do. Pro tip, get washcloth specifically designed for your skin. Next, I'm gonna take this Belief Moisturizing Balm. Always put moisturizer on your neck. Next, I'm just gonna take this Mario Badescu. I don't know how to pronounce his name. Rose Hips Nourishing Oil. Why is it called hips? I don't know. So now I'm looking very greasy. Next, sunblock. Doesn't matter if it's raining, Sunny, cloudy, doesn't matter if you're going to be inside all day. Always wear sunblock. As you may notice, I got a little bit of dark circles under the eyes. So I'm going to use this Clinique All About Eyes Serum, which I just apply a tad bit under the eyes. And then pat ever so slightly. Then I just take some Vaseline or Protope. Vaseline. Put that on the lips. And I'm just going to spray my face. And then we're done. So next, let's go pick up my outfit. Okay, so I changed. Today's a pretty chill day, so I don't need to wear something crazy. I just got this shirt yesterday, actually, from Urban. These jeans are from a denim shop on Melrose. Look at on the back of the shirt, how cute that is. I don't know if you can see. Oh, I still have the tag on. That's nice. So yeah, now let's clean that beautiful mess. Random dance break. Okay, work it. Yes, let's go. Okay, hit the poses, dance. Yes. Okay, Jaden, I see you. You better work it. Woo! Mm, okay, woo! Okay, no. I'm way too impatient for this. Can we speed it up? Much better. Look at this little basketball I got. It's pink. It bounces! Kobe! Oh! Now it's time for makeup. Hello, so now I'm actually filming on my phone because this little guy right here doesn't react well to these lights but my phone does. So I haven't done anything makeup related in a long time. My makeup routine has definitely become more simple. Look at my nails. Oh, I saw my phone slipping. I'm gonna go put water on this beauty blender. Be right back. Alrighty, so first of all, I am already moisturized, so I'm just gonna use concealer first. I don't do foundation, that's way too much. So I got this Milk Concealer and I got this NARS Concealer. This shade is way too dark for my skin, this is way too light for my skin, so I just 
kind of do them both at the same time and it kind of makes the perfect color for my skin. Two dots of the light and two dots of the dark. And I used to use this little brush to blend my concealer, but that really creates a lot of lines even when you put powder and this just makes it look so much more natural when I use a beauty blender. I haven't done makeup on my YouTube in so long. So this is like really cool. Brings back old memories. Okay, girl, you better work. Okay, first of all, it has a cute quote. It says, a cheek without rouge is like a cake without frosting. True though. There's more content for you. Okay, maybe those are bad memories. Oof, literally when I watch those old videos. <laughs> Love you, old Jaden, but ne you need help. <laughs> then usually I don't do this, but since my literal eyelid is so red, I will put some of this different NARS concealer that I'm running out of. Now I'm going to use some powder on my face so I'm not so shiny. Just the Glossier, Oh, birdies. I use the Glossier powder and brush. Why am I so pale? Am I pale? My grandma says I'm olive. What? Olives are black, are black, right? What? <laughs> wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Aren't olives like brown or sometimes black? Someone please answer me, I'm really confused. Okay, now what I usually do is I will take a neutral color. I'll usually just take a brown and do a very light color on my eyes. It also makes my green eyes pop. Right now they look so, oh wait, no, they look a little green. Does that look green to you? But yeah, my eyes are green, but not everyone knows that because sometimes they look brown. Then I just take the same color under my eyes very slightly. High plain. Next, my favorite thing in the world, mascara. Well, first I gotta curl my eyes, but curl my eyes, my eyelashes. <laughs> Woo! I mean, look at that difference. That's crazy. I use the Glossier Lash Lick, Glossier, whatever you want to call it. I literally hear something in my backyard. It's probably a squirrel. Oh my God, at night we get raccoons. I have a video of one, actually a baby one. I have a video of a baby one. Literally the grossest thing I've ever seen. Then for my eyebrows, I will use the boy brow just to give my eyebrows a tiny bit of color. But then I also use the elf gel so I can put my eyebrows in place and they won't move. I got a text. Now, because I'm really pale, I do blush and I just use the MAC blush. Look at, I have a mini picture of Armani on it because I was trying to make a tiny picture to put in a locket I have, but it didn't work. So I just put it on my blush. I don't know why. I like the look of a lot of blush. I think it's super cute. Then I just take some lip balm and we're done. This is just what I do every day. It takes me like five minutes and now, Let's do my hair. Alrighty, so for my hair, done. Literally having short hair is a blessing because I don't even have to do anything. I usually just go like this. I don't know why. I think it gives it volume or something. Sometimes I'll take a blow dryer to it if it needs more volume, but literally I like it how it is natural. I just leave it like this pretty much every day except for when I have an event, so. Easiest part of my day. Okay, so now I'm actually gonna change my earrings. Um, I just got my ears pierced recently. So I've been super obsessed with earrings. Here's all my earrings. I organized them on this little peach plate. Let's change these. Okay, I'm gonna put my hair back. Okay, so I'm gonna put in some earrings that I've actually never worn. So I always put a little bit of this after piercing lotion on all my earrings, but I'm putting in this really tiny, small earring. And then I'm also gonna put in this dangly one I might take it out if it doesn't look good, but I've never worn a dangly one before, so we shall see. I don't think I like it very much. <laughs> Why does that look so weird on me? I don't like it at all, in fact. So I'm just gonna put in these other dangly ones from Urban that I've actually also never worn before, so hopefully they look good. That is so cute. One's a star and one's a moon. Okay, this one's a lot cuter. Earrings are done, hair is done. Now all that's left is to announce the winner of my giveaway! So last week I posted a video where I announced my first ever giveaway. You can watch it right there. There are three winners. Here are their usernames on Instagram. Drum roll please! Ta-da! 
congratulations you guys you won i will be contacting you on instagram so keep an eye out for that thank you to everyone who entered um i had so much fun doing this i can't wait to send out the gifts i love you all so so much and like this video if you enjoyed subscribe next week i have such a fun video planned that you guys will definitely want to watch so stay tuned i love you guys and i'll see you next time bye